Hello friends, uh, this is Antonio one more time here with a quick recipe for you, quick and delicious recipe for you. Uh, today I'm going to show you how to make caprese salad. I believe that's how you pronounce it. Uh, forgive me if it's if I'm mispronouncing it, but suffice to say that it is really delicious. <laughs> Alright, here are the ingredients that you're going to need. Uh, back there you see some balsamic vinegar. You're going to need uh, salt olive oil, black pepper, in this case I'm using three tomatoes, some fresh mozzarella cheese, and my favorite herb, well one of my favorite fresh herbs of all is uh, basil, fresh basil which you see back there in the corner. Alright so this is the way that I prepare it and uh, let's get started. Okay the first thing I'm gonna do is um, cut my tomatoes that's the very first step so here I am gonna cut them into thin slices like you see me doing here go ahead and do that to all three tomatoes okay looking good next what I like to do is I like to arrange the tomatoes in a, in a dish so I'll just take the tomato slices and place them like this Alright, so that's, I just like to place them like that in a circle. I think it gives a little bit better presentation that way. Like that. Okay, that's looking good. Next. I'm going to take my fresh mozzarella cheese. And this cheese right here is, uh, it is very, very good, very fresh very creamy and tasty and it comes pre-sliced I'll show you what I mean see how easy that slid um, sliced ca or came apart just like that you see that it's pre-sliced and you see how rubbery and flexible it is it's just very very fresh and that's what you want you want to have fresh mozzarella cheese okay what I like to do is I take the cheese and I, and I slice it in half like that. Then what I do is I I, I put uh, a slice of cheese in between each slice of tomato. You will appreciate this easy to make dish. And if you've never had it, just a combination of the balsamic vinegar the olive oil, the salt, and the basil. My goodness, the basil is what gives this dish just an overall really, really good taste. Okay. A few more pieces of cheese here. Okay, so that's what it looks like so far when you arrange it in a circle. And I don't know if you agree with me, but a lot of times when you prepare food, the presentation has a lot to do with it. And sometimes it just look, makes it look more appetizing. At least that's my opinion. Okay, let's set this to the side. Next item is my basil. This is fresh basil. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to take my scissors and cut some of the leaves off. All right, this is very, very fresh. Okay, let's see here. A good little bunch like this should be good. Maybe a little more. About like that. That's good. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and rinse this real quick. Okay, I went ahead and rinsed the basil. What I like to do is I like to bunch it up like this. And I take my knife and then I just slice it thinly like that. Alright, that looks good. Go ahead and sprinkle the basil on the tomatoes. Just like that. 
see. That's how it should look right there. We're almost done. Okay, next what I like to do is I like to take my olive oil and you're gonna lightly sprinkle olive, olive oil on the tomatoes. Not too much. I would say here I'm using maybe four tablespoons of olive oil. Just slightly drizzle it on the tomatoes and the, uh, the, uh, the basil and the cheese. Next go ahead and take your balsamic vinegar and also drizzle it. <gasps> Oops. Just be careful, okay? Just drizzle it like that. On the tomatoes. All right. Again, I probably used about four tablespoons of uh, of the ba of the uh, balsamic vinegar. Next, take your sea salt and also put a dash of uh, sea salt on the tomatoes. Half of a teaspoon of salt. Of course, you can add more to taste. All right. And lastly, you're going to sprinkle some uh, coarse uh, ground pepper. Just like that. And there you have it, folks. Caprese salad. Uh, uh, this is just the way that I prepare it. And all the ingredients are really fresh. And it's a great appetizer. If you have a family or company coming over to your house, go ahead and prepare this. You can put it in the refrigerator and chill it for about 15, 20 minutes and uh, serve it cold and I guarantee it your guests your family will like it all right let me know what you think of it and until next time this is Antonio signing off take care have a great day bye bye